Welcome everyone to our corner of YouTube developing Linux distribution. Today it helps you a little if you have a techno technologically technically amazing Linux distribution supporting all CPU architectures and C libraries and stuff. Number one in product marketing stuff is of course design, product design and polishing the heck out of it. Case in point for um, like if it what helps you a little if, if it doesn't look good, right? Whether it's cars or, I, or smartphones and, and computers and stuff. And so case in point, um, I've not, actually did I, so I've not invented this installer stuff, our setup to one, I probably, I, I co-authored that probably, but so what, I'm um, actually, so when I forked Rock Linux, um, in like 20 years ago, 25 years ago, when I started to contribute to Rock Linux, that previously was um, is not T2. Um, all my patches work not right. I said it before. I, I like I installed it. it. It was generally amazing. Just like NFS didn't work, and then all the desktop stuff wasn't in there and stuff. And so I sent NFS, NFS, whatever kernel, whatever NFS utils fixes, whatever um, desktop packages like Xemacs, like GIMP or whatever stuff like that. And it's like yeah, you look, nobody cared, right? So I forked that. And with a desktop rock Linux, like from 1998. So. I actually, we, we also polished the installer a bit, right? We later reuni reunified that. But so case in point, my point today is like for, I mean, I knew, I, I always thought like this installer is, um, it's a similar to the Beast installers, right? Or maybe somewhat Debian or whatever. Um, so what annoyed me, I mean, we are, we are not going to re rewrite that today. And in general, before you say like text mode and whatnot, um, we install on lots of Unix, vintage retro machines and stuff where you do not necessarily have graphic, right? Maybe some days, like, yeah, probably number one product design, make it look like Mac OS um, coming next year or so. But there are low hanging fruits, right? And I said this yesterday, I got the last 14 days, I was overloaded with test results. It's so totally amazing, right? <laughs> Previous video, outsourcing testing to the open source community um, and have your test unit your quality assurance for free. So one of those things, and I knew that, that this, like this navigation sucks a bit. Um, like here's this, okay, continue. Uh, okay, let's, okay, this we can throw away. Um, so let's, my, my point is let's polish that at least a little bit. So what annoyed me always, um, so the, the comment was like this exit thing, like we have here like sometimes back and exit. That's, I knew that was a little bit confusing, but this is the stuff I care about, the technical details, right? Whether the spec and exit, it's like, ah, it, it's not, but that's the point, right? I made previous videos of BSD criticizing BSD stuff, like first Linux, like core Linux developer distribution that tries BSDs and other stuff, previous video. If you also, if you're new to this channel, I have probably a thousand videos doing random stuff. Looking at BSDs, looking at Haiku, like looking on uh, Redux OS. So, I mean, this is the kind of stuff, and that that is a different of perception, right? If it's your own stuff, you usually don't care as much because there yeah, it somewhat works. I have better things to do, right? So, the viewer, uh, not not the viewer, the, the new user comment was like, yeah, can we not rename the this exit button? Your because sometimes 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 it's exit, sometimes it's back, and it's also uh, let's maybe install it because then it becomes a little bit more apparent. But the thing is, I cannot always do what people send me, right? If you send me an email, like, hey, can you rename this? Can you, not not everything like similar to like being a little bit, they're, they're always like product designer and, and like senior general developers and stuff. They always need to be gatekeepers of like product designers and gatekeepers and stuff. Like if you, if you accept each random or whatever, ex like someone's best suggestion, it will be become a pile of random garbage, right? So for example, the su suggestion was to rename it something I, like, their proposal was a very long, like return to main menu. So I, like quoting from, I'm not opening the email, but so I responded like, yeah, the name the name's a little bit long and right. Like I can agree, may, maybe we rename it to, um, so here's only, Okay, and that is also, 
I probably today also will name, rename OK, right? Like 20 years later. And that's the stuff I did not even realize it, right? You, you are basically for your own development and your own stuff, you are blind. You become blind to your own bugs and imperfections, right? Similar to Apple, right? Pricing Apple. Like I have such a long list of peak bugs, hashtag I even made years before this YouTube, like probably 10 years ago, I made up peak bugs because everything at Apple in my perception becomes more buggy every release, right? Um, but so like, why is this okay? So this is, this is upstream dialogue. We are using this dialogue stuff here. So this is upstream Unix dialogue, like, why is that even okay, right? So, the, so this is, we are, we are not doing anything and the dialogue stuff comes up with okay. And so that was not even their proposal. Their proposal was like, this exit here sucks. Uh, yes, I agree. Their proposal was rename it to return to main menu, which that, that's the thing, right? You can, as I said, I, I, I need to be a little bit of a gatekeeper and I cannot always, like if you have an amazing idea, I'm happy for your amazing idea. I cannot always just do every amazing idea because maybe sometimes they're also not that amazing. The, the problem with return to main menu is, in my opinion, I'm also a little bit, I, I even studied media design, media design. Uh, it's long, long time ago, probably so. Was it media or media informatic? Media computer science. What even was it? Whatever the precise title was, who cares about bloody university shit. Um, I mean, not only I like design and stuff, working, drawing, painting, design stuff. Um, I did even study that. Uh, I probably should like look, look up my own, own stuff, what I studied. But so my point is, I have also a little bit, believe it or not, with, with the tech stuff, a little bit the eyes of a designer. And like, obviously, like, a button that is like five times as long just for the return to main. I mean, this button, it looks unbalanced, right? You cannot have like one OK button and one return to main menu stuff. Like it would literally from from there to, to there, right? Um, and also, I mean, exit also sucks. I mean, obviously exit sucks because the problem is like, this is not really exit. Um, and the problem is renaming is not even the most simple because all those building blocks here, all those setup building blocks can also be reused different. Um, single you you can later like here it is stepping through the installer and later you can also run them manually in, in single quantities so that makes sense um and so they did not even notice the okay button then i was sitting the other day like like why is it even okay it's like in my opinion even okay sucks and maybe even so because what, what is okay, right? It's, it's select, unselect, like continue, what like, like literally most things would be better than freaking okay. I mean, what should okay even mean, right? Um, so I'm inclined, like use a suggestion, this exit return continue shit button here sucks. And then I look at this like, yeah, wait a second, this okay button also sucks, right? Um, here, so here, for example, is exit. I mean, because it's not exit, right? It is, it's like basically mostly continuous. So the problem is I can't even easily rename it because sometimes like in this case, it is continue. And in other cases, it's exit or return. Um, I might even, um, I might even rename it continue anyway. And that, that's the thing, right? I mean, unless, sure, we could make it even more amazing by like if we wanted to do it even more amazing we would need a special mode of is it run after the installation or is it run in a sequentially scripted installation step um, because then then it would be more like one is return like in usually like if you so this is how you would run it like if you have installed our linux distribution and you just run the setup tool again after the installation that is so okay here it is quit that is fine Okay, here's exit, that is also, I mean, okay, to be fair, that makes somewhat sense. Um, I'm not even, so I might have added, it, it is possible that if you installed T2, the last T2 or Rock Linux, the last 25 years, this might have been okay. I, I started to rename it already, right? Um, it's, but it's more than one place. I mean, so here it is indeed, okay, but even there, you see, because that is part of the script installation, now the quit was not even quit. I mean, usually that, that is the thing, right? And yeah, you see the, but, but anyway, if we wanted to, um, if we want to put 
money where our mouth is criticizing other beasties and, and stuff, um, we need to do better, right? And one one early one initial step, like the first step, is like fix the naming. And so even okay sucks, right? So so this would be if you run setup now. Um, also, which term do we have now? All right, maybe actually. All right, I probably wanna. Ah, oh, that's interesting. Um, probably should change that too. I just started to change this, and so th this is also uh, historically I had run this with VT one and two, and I also became so blinded. Right, this is why T two Linux now often becomes better and better than many Linux versions because I did not even think about this. Right, for me, a serial console was then like VT one hundred two or stuff, and then it took twenty five years until last week that new professional users wrote me. Like, hey, this looks amazing, but can you change? That's like, I'm not making this up when each day I got multiple emails, right? The last 14 days, absolutely mind blowing. Probably the fastest growing Linux distribution of 2023. Um, and that is the stuff, and that is what makes open source and the community so amazing, right? Because I never thought about this. And they were like, hey, can you not change this to X term or so? But like, he, they, they're saying is basically, like, there is like X term like stuff. And old vintage garbage that nobody like VT102 and stuff that nobody freaking really works. Because like now the, the issue is nobody, like even I don't have, I never had a real hardware terminal thing, right? And so that suggestion was like, why use this old garbage, VT102 by default, for example, here? I did oh wait, we actually would we would actually we have an issue. <coughs> I believe we need to patch, actually, we need to patch. Uh, that is actually the default in, in this 5 init anyway. So yeah, I just started to rename this for, for the installer. So in the latest, in the new ISOs, T2 on the serial console will use Xterm, or Xterm color. So uh, just to make, because everyone is using it with virtual machines, containers, um, or on a serial console with an Xterm, like whatever thing. And like if you have something else, then just change it, right? Making this like product design and polishing, right? Making the install. Um, and so experience even better. So it doesn't need to be vintage, whatever. Like maybe patch that instantly. Or should we do that? Okay, okay let's put this on the to do, uh, not to mix uh, too many topics here. Um, patch this five in a VT102 serial default. Let's maybe quickly. I think I didn't commit this yet. Uh, I have this here started. I started this locally. And that would be term i extreme color. I believe extreme color is fair because I mean, obviously, very few people have a monochrome display these days anyway. To a default extreme color and in the example. Um, so th that is one thing. And then let's um, f uh, right because it is not term extreme color. So, yeah, I mean, obviously, like, why have a lesser experience than color extreme? And th that's not even extreme, right? I'm running this in Alacrity, but as those new users suggested, like, all those news, all those new hyper hardware isolated JavaScripted and whatnot, basically extreme with, it's like, you're not implementing a totally non standard term. I mean, also this. Terminal, so I'm rolling here over VGA cables again. Also, I mean, obviously, this all those um, terminals like Alacrity and so also like super pointless, like why not just use extreme color and be 100% compatible? The only argument would be um, you implement, uh, you implement, like you fix bugs, like you're not bug compatible because extreme more bugs or whatever. Um, so yeah, so let's take a quick look. So, okay, because, I mean, because, okay, this is exit. I mean, so, okay, so their suggestion was exit is not really exit. And I mean, yeah, I agree. The, so the problem is, and so, I, I mean, it's a small thing, right? But they are right. It was like, obviously making this less confusing. Um, so probably like I mean okay is like like why okay right like okay is like more like skip okay okay I've seen it but lot I would actually 
this this probably should kind of be select um i started to patch that also like if you have further input comments below right send me pat patches welcome so um I started to do that here already, so there is um, a, a co. I, I renamed that, so I guess select is better. So this is GUI dialog. Uh, GUI dialog, of which we have some uh, set up. Okay, there is root password x11. All right, this is. Theoretically, we have the next 11 front end for reasons. I mean, we could sim simply maybe modernize it with some modern. I mean, I'm not even sure if it's nah, whatever. So, UI dialog um, gets mostly in here. UI dialog. So, this is a little bit funny. So, I've not done that, but this is like 80 columns minus one. It's like, yeah, a little, little bit funny. It's, it, is what it is what it is. Um, so where do we have that UI command menu UI okay label so this I uh, if ID main so here we could somewhere like later like I, I do not do this today because I finally want to release this most amazing release ever so this I already renamed um, cancel so this is either main or so here I have and that is the thing uh, maybe we should. Don't take flights in this day and age. And keep warm and stuff. Um, so main is select and I mean command UI else if no cancel mm, otherwise okay this is probably other yeah. Okay, label select two. Uh, what did I probably so and so they suggested return to main menu, but the problem is, I mean, I mean maybe continue like for now. Continue usually works. Let's maybe do we have more? Uh, UI. There is actually some. Cancel label back actually. We dialog. What else do we have here? Use text default for name. Um, probably we need. So which UI input? Oh, this is no cancel. Okay, whatever. So no, the question is okay if we. Because that would then still have this OK label. Um, UI message, yes, no. Yes, no headline. Okay, maybe this is uh, most already. So I built here a new musel. Um, built overnight, as you do. Sorry, Danny, I only get to that now. Danny has a question. Let's rebuild that. Uh, you have GCC 13.2, but when is when up there is try. So yeah, I did not commit this. I have this locally because the GCC people didn't release it. It's not ideal. I probably should kinder commit that. That is because even the latest stable release GCC series has too many bugs that breaks too many of our fancy risk architectures. Of some we debugged live recently. Um, I know that is not ideal. So basically, eMerge will probably not update this. I probably like this really should be in the. So the reason I didn't commit is because it's some developments or like some release snapshot. I probably should commit it anyway. I mean, before I had I had hopes that the GCC people release GCC whatever the next minor stable release is before Christmas. Um, Probably the hope are unrealistic because previous video not very not not very professional free software foundation release practices, but yeah, um, yeah. 
So, uh, so that is that. Let's uh, also we had to select right. So musel. Then I need to check what I currently have in this run. So I have clean user. Then let's install that. So that should have our just oh so I forgot to add Siri console. Probably one day or sometime soon. And that's the thing, right? Now that I have five years live on YouTube perfected so many things, now we can work on the nice things, right? Like small little details, a little bit polishing there, a little bit nice. Like I, I would love if Grub on AFI could bloody somehow detect that it's a Siri. Like like why has why has Red Hat and IBM not do it, done that, right? Or any of all the other containerization orchestration stuff. Um, Danny asked, should I just use then one version prior to that? I mean, <coughs> excuse me, T, T2 as committed also builds, right? The, the, the GCC snapshot are mostly for like Spark 64, Itanium 64, um, maybe even Super H, what was? Uh, stuff like that. Um, you can just, I mean, for most normal things, but, but even for x86, I just checked actually yesterday, uh, the GCC GitHub, uh, uh, Git com commit stuff. They even have vital, I, I just don't understand why the free software foundation is not monthly putting out, like it costs like next to nothing, right? Auto freaking automate, like us, like monthly run, like if, if stuff settles down and like just like just run your script and release it as dot one dot two like this is not rocket science right and because even for AVX software just yesterday I looked at there's even x86 fixes in there right like like why not um, release it I is beyond my it's but you can just use t2 trunk stuff just builds right um it's it's mostly spark 64 and uh, like other risk stuff so um, Oh, okay, wait, I actually saw, we, so we have now select, I mean, because mostly it's continue, right? Why did I rename this? Because it, it's not back or quit or exit, right? It's like, like bloody, like skips this. I mean, and I, I mean, I'm at Apple, it's probably usually skip in macOS, but I rather have it named continue. The, the thing is, for now, I'm not rewriting all the installer today, right? I just want to perfect this a little bit as, as new users already realized, hey, that's confusing. Let's just lowest hanging fruit, polish it a little bit, right? Be before rewriting it completely. So that is select. I mean, previously this was okay. In my opinion, leave me in the comments below. Is select better than okay? Like, I, I guess it's select, right? I would say. Um, be because like previously this was okay. Like, like how is okay okay? It's, and I did not even realize, like, like you're getting blind, right? Probably most Unix stuff always used okay. And I somehow, I 25 years grow so, so accustomed to it that I didn't even pay attention that it's bloody labeled okay, right? I mean, it's a small thing, but it's like, it's it's the small things that make up amazing product design. Um, so that's basically okay. So like basically, I mean, continue is, what is even continue? Continue breaks out here. I mean, I mean, that's, that's an out. I said make it better for 90% of the cases or so, right? So that is select, it's basically, that's, it's select, right? Would it, or, or we make, name it Star Trek, Star Trek Next Generation, make it so. Should we have a Star Trek TNG, Jean-Luc Picard, make it so edition? Hey, we could, we could rename it, make it so, like we could make a fun release of make it so and return to main menu, but um, all seriousness, so select that. Um, yes, no, so, uh, um, make it so, so select, I mean, I think select is better than okay. I mean, continue is kind of like, the thing is, I mean, here, I mean, return, but, but usually it's not return, right? Usually it is more continue. This is why I'm more inclined, like, make it, except some outliers, I guess, continue is better than Exit. I, previously there was exit, right? Uh, exit or, or back. Actually there was, previously there was back, I think. So, but often it is also not back. So I guess, 
Yeah, because in the script installation, what most users see is this script installation steps after this, and there it's not back. So previously there was, oh wait, here, so yeah, here, here we even also select, so here we have select already, that, that is another program, and here we have, so at least it's also consistent. And that's why, that, why, why do I live stream this? Because I need to do it anyway, right? If I want to release a better Linux version, I need to sit here and do the work, right? This one can also, before you, why do I waste your my time live streaming this? It needs to be done, it, need, it needs to be tested, it needs to be prototyped, it needs to be evaluated. So I think it's mostly better except small corner cases, which yes, we could further, I believe they probably could be further improved with adding some flag. I was like, yeah, there's just some space stuff. I think this is some kind of musal thing, I probably should. Um, okay, so maybe this is actually, you know what, this probably should also be um, okay. So what, what is it, that, uh, which mode is that? So we, we forgot there's some mode or, or skipped over some mode, was it here? Um, stone mod, was it, uh, which even mod? The UI, stone UI, dialog of dialog. Um, so which mode, so menu? We, Okay, label, so we, I mean, basically we probably could um, pre-fill this command with UI dialog dash dash, okay, label, select. Um, input, so which would that be? I mean, if you, ent when you enter the password, I read it today. Can't find oh no. Um okay let's so this is not message. Where would that be? Which one would that edit command? Um input uh, is this this one? Here's even still back um Oops. Okay, here is no, so it's not that. Input text default volume. Which other UI menu title action? Don't even instantly see which. Um, oh, wait, is it even a UI dialog? Maybe we could refold that here with, if this is a dialogue to run, we probably could OK label. Anyway, um, which one would that be? That is keyboard mapping general. This is general Key map select one, which is it even? This is UI menu. Important to know element of tree name corresponds to UI menu. Now, this is this one. Um, main, okay, label select. Ah, here is no cancel. Okay, probably. Okay, there is no cancel. So, um, I guess it makes sense to not uh, delete, paste, which one was it, command equals that, and then Command, uh, command, and select no command. Um, okay, let's test a little bit further. And so that would be select. I mean, select is more professional, right? Um, I mean, could leave 
OK here. So that is select and continue. So yeah, because like here continue, and that is what most people see, right? Except we name it skip. But again, as I mentioned 10 minutes ago, skip does not make sense for, I mean, a continuous probably more universal. Does it even work here? Oh, it does work. Um, okay, here's back though. Um, okay, back. Okay, that still sucks stone. I mean, in this kind of cases, skip would clarify that a little bit more because like you have, the question is, Which one is that even? Why? Oh, this is some editing thing, so there must be still some more. Is it still back? Ah, oh, here is input. Okay, so okay, let's still name this continue. Is this no console? No, this is not a no console. Uh, is this not input? Wait, what do we... Ah, because this is no console. Ah, okay. Um, so probably also let's... The temp evil... Command... Let's... Do I still have... Oh, no, I didn't because... Okay, button select. Yeah, so in this case, in this is one of the rare cases where okay wasn't that bad, but because then con like you have select. What else would be more universal? But even again, if it makes ninety percent of the cases better, I'm already happy and welcome everyone. Um, so, I guess it's already better than nothing, so let's, let's give it one more try, command, no, cancel, and cancel and command, and if you have any questions right now, your message, yeah, fine. so, so this would be select, I mean, or we name it confirm. Is it eh, select confirm? Eh. Yes, no, okay. I mean, we could. I mean, maybe it should never be okay. I mean, okay is really silly. Um, this was okay. In that, which label would that be? That would be, because it's basically continue, right? Like if we wanna, which one was it even? This was message, was it message? What what message was it? So select, because so this is neither back, I mean, like con continue, yeah, anyway. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm also a little bit, select, con I mean, con um, the thing is, usually it is select. Um, I think I, I leave that for now and like now that we have attributed this label names in more places, in later substitutions would, would be easier. Um, second try, made partition manually and everything went smooth, used uh, in the process all the distributions and just assumed the same. Yeah, we are, we are working on that, right? So like, patch is always welcome. And I'm also taking all this input seriously, right? Of all the GitHub, Discord and email, um, it is probably like this, and that is also polishing, right? We have this year build time estimates, um, polishing installation, um, all the Musil and Clang builds uh, working uh, more smoothly and full featured and stuff. And that is like, that is the thing be between you, like all the other 2034 Linux distributions who somehow like that, that work somewhat. And, and that's also, I mean, obviously there are 
triple A Linux distributions like T2 or Red Hat and SUSE and stuff. And there are all those hobby projects of some people clobbering something together and it somewhat works or stuff. And, and that's the difference between why is there not the, the Linux desktop? Because stuff is not, even on Red Hat and SUSE, stuff is not as polished as it should be. I mean, obviously we are far away from a Mac OS. Obviously <laughs> need Mac OS or Windows. Um, for the Linux desktop, maybe we should work on that next, but uh, also personally. But the thing is also, I, I don't want, like, I want to support also embedded devices. We, we support embedded devices and other, I mean, hey, some 3G base stations were running. I'm, I'm, I'm not making this shit up, you know what, let's, let's, let's disclose something. I said this before, I hope, I hope this is the right box. Um, some, some base stations, unfortunately we didn't, we didn't win the following. Um, some of your UMTS calls were rooted with T2. Uh, actually back in the day Rock Linux, this was when I, when I run Rock Linux, so like yeah. What, what is that? That is carrier grade compact PCI like a decade ago some of your phone calls were and data why does this not come out um, it's like yeah I, I've been there I've I've done that and and yet a, f a fuse blew on this um, this is compact PCI base station stuff um, in, in case you're wondering uh, power PC um, freescale or so no Motorola. I think Motorola. How much was it? Eight hundred megahertz, something of that sort. Yeah, been there, done that, um, and uh, so yeah, embedded stuff, right? And um, on embedded stuff, you don't simply. I mean, even the Sun now Oracle stuff is less colorful when you boot, boot at one slide out, out management stuff. Um, and by, by the way, if you are uh, like, yeah, um, if you need professional services, like if Huawei and, and Ericsson and stuff, like, hey, if you want to renew your base station stuff with a top notch um, high performance secure and stuff, and hey, we're working on a microcode. <laughs> Like if, if you want to renew your base station stuff for five five G six G with like less broken stuff, um, my emails are open. Um, why is this offset by the way? Why is there a black only now? Do I realize? Oh no, there is a black bar. Ah, this is probably the terminal. Okay. Um, so uh, yes, no. What did we we wanted somewhere? Did did we even UI input or what? It, it was that one, right? Okay, button select. But yeah, and also I'm, I have no illusions that I, we will not be more successful than Red Hat and SUSE or Oracle's broken Linux selling desktop Linux. So this is why I'd rather do what I need. I mean, I only need a browser and, and a terminal, right? Um, and given that I have no illusions that we will not be successful in this space between Apple and Microsoft, I will rather do a microkernel next because that is what I really wanted since 25 years and never really got. And that is also more technolo not technologically interesting also maybe for potential customers in their carrier grade or automotive space or space or whatnot. Um, and I rather do, I mean obviously not, not, not only I want a more stable, scalable and, and developer friendly microkernel system. Um, that also has a higher potential, much better potential to sell successfully to a commercial business product. So did I probably UI input this, was this one, right? Uh, okay, button select, no cancel or continue, was it in proc? Yeah, this was this one. Um, so yeah, next, probably more next year, microcon stuff. Actual rocket science, so configure, so okay. So this we just renamed, this is like, 
Yeah, we probably, uh, because, I mean, if we have the select continue, it means there will always be something. So here's either select this stuff. I mean, what was it, where's the other? The other was confirm. I mean, con this is not really confirm, right? So this is either, I mean, a select is pretty close. Select, continue, select, continue. Hmm. Okay, so let's rebuild that. Let's do that one more try. So that is Mural Stone. Select, so this is quit. That is, oops. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, that's, that's quit. So do you want. Um, okay, fine. Also, we, we probably just, we just do this again. So that build there. Um, yes, microcolon. So. Posted a GCC error log on the Discord so you can pick in later. Set stone set up to one. It's in the screen. What are you saying? Synchronizer. I can define the default behavior just like wanted to follow recommended settings. I mean, I'm I made already like with the partitioning and con bringing up the network configuration up. I had the impression I already improved the recommended settings, especially with auto. I mean, our new auto partitioning probably should uh, resolve most of the installation hiccups. And I mean, some installation hiccups there were because the Musil and Clang images I posted were incomplete. Um, also in the Future console in the future I will be more professional and the last times here on YouTube I arsened the ISOs into the top level data directory. That's of course not very professional that I keep updating and arsinking over those ISOs. So multiple times the last 14 days I, I refreshed Spark 64 Itanium. Um, that's of course not very good style to update um, ISO releases with the same name. In the future, I will do this in some Zync or incoming subfolder or something of that sort. So, um, yeah. What what are you being by the way? Second try, make the petition manually. Everything. Uh, about a stone. All right. So stone is our setup tool one. Um, we had from Rock Linux times a funny funny name. So yeah. Um, stone is st setup tool um, setup tool one um, just to a funny name so we have select and continue um, we have select and continue we, we have select and continue oh this is also yeah you but that is dialogue it's like you you can select the titles as it's but yeah it is what it is I guess um, yeah, we have yes. I mean, it's yes, no, it's okay, fine, yes, no. Better if as install select continue. Okay, this so this is this matches here to gas or game auto install. Need to get away with it. Um, so that is select and um, that matches. Um, I guess we found our places. Another thing, um. The polishing I already polished often even live here on this channel um, the build output and one thing I also further noticed do I have here others no. um, I noticed the other day building or like maybe even just yesterday or so so and I already improved the build output right with build output I mean so that is uh, let's uh, I mean, theoretically, we could name that continue, but I mean, if continue is usually uh, skip or continue without choosing this, I probably should not name this continue. Um, Helsinki today, just because, why not? So, um, grubs, that is okay. Oh, wait, there's still one okay. Um, why was there okay? So select, so select any of this, continue. There was still shit, I did this too fast. Yeah, pro tip, don't, don't skip over your stuff too fast. 
So no, so select continue, select continue. Um, there was still one okay thing. Select quit, select. So here, here would be the only, so this, this is what I mean. We would have a, we could have back here, this is like a, I think it still matches enough and better than before. Um, which was it? This was still, I think this was grub. Was it grub? I do not, we can redo that. Uh, da, 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 create. Uh, here is okay. We could still name this continue. If we wanted to get rid of all the case, if we agree that okay is not the best choice. Um, Luke says gets in GCC error also. What kind of what kind of GCC error are you talking about? Um, what is so grub is using boot grub stone message this okay this is ui message okay here message box here we have that um so it probably also okay label uh, okay button okay here is continue I mean, it's basically only like, okay, I've seen it. I mean, okay, it's also not select, right? So, because this also means we can't do this globally if sometimes we just have continue. So input, yes, no, okay, yes, no. So, I guess three times the charm here. Okay, I could check. Only hope I, but probably this opens in T2, right? Not, oh, this opens in this, T2 packages of, I probably need to download that. <coughs> oh, this is, is this just? So how, okay, what kind of build is that? That is, is this has T2 source. Um, are you building, which stage level is that? So where is the, function, no operator, uh, what? Undefined reference to operator delete. Uh, I'm not sure if I know that you say that. Um, I'm just not sure if I have. So what do you build? Is that even, do we see the stage level? In, is it a local, is it a fresh ISO or? Okay, you locally, okay, Luke gets this in stage one. Do you get exactly that in stage one as well, Luke? This, un, what was it? Uh, This uh, undefined reference to operator delete what long stuff in reader. Mm, builds for me fully, that is interesting. Um, so we built that. Uh, do we need to uh, we better rebuild this? Um, yeah, just in case. Probably we. 
Uh, that, that, I have not seen that. That is. Um, don't tell me there is a regression where the latest stable snapshot. Yeah, I, I rebuilt so much. That is crazy. Um, but to be fair, I usually don't rebuild my GCC in a system. I probably should do that sometimes. Yeah, terminal is also in some other state. So that's ISO build. Ah, so yeah, oh, this is a ISO build, not in. So it's pure. That's my ISO build from. Ah, so you built your own ISO. So you you built your own ISO, installed your own ISO. Did, did I get that right? Okay, so one hopefully last test here. Oh, also, maybe I should actually read this. This is like continue. Um, select. Yes, no. Still better if I select continue. Hmm. That is, but what do you saw? Hmm. The problem with this kind of stuff, it's it's hard to debug if you don't get this error, right? So, so like, yeah, I've seen this a couple of, this is what, is that, no, this is Muse or right? whatever, I probably should debug that someday. Okay, select here. Uh, select, continue, basically, that is skip, that works. Okay, now if you continue, much better than okay, probably. And that's, that's like, that's adding so much value. This is a super small step for just some little developer renaming here, small step for developer, but a huge step of user perception, right? Like if all the stuff is labeled confusing, I would say it's an order of magnitude improvement. Sure, some, some stuff is still, um, okay, this is still, Select is here slightly, I mean, continuous, continuous. For what we can simply do here without significantly writing it, it it's, it's probably a huge improvement. I would kind of say okay is okay-ish here, but what, what is that here? That is, it's basically, I mean, Is select good enough here, or should is is this a rare case where, where okay is better? Someone when you fix something. Um, so it sounds like Danny has that also in stage one, right? This is bizarre. Um, so so this is a text edit thing, right? Is that? Is there really, should we rename that OK cancel? Because of previously we had here OK. What was previously here? OK and back. Of course, it's a little bit over perfecting that, but as we touch it now, um, what, what would that be? UI. UI edit, cannot find an editor. Okay, this is okay. Um, what even is that? Uh, input probably, huh? Cancel label. Was it cancel? What even is the default console label? Console label. Hmm. 
Let's quickly test them. Oh, wait, I didn't build it. So the one more thing I wanted to polish is getting rid of some In some raw state. I hate this, by the way. The stuff that really should work better. But it, it's simply basically because all the Unix people always accepted that, right? It's like it, it, it is what it is. It's a terminal, so you 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 killed something in the middle of raw mode positioning, whatever. You get what it. So the other thing is uh, what I started ten minutes ago is here. This echo status musical pending patches. So. Um, Basically, it's an it's basically a developer thing, right? So let's grab a pen patch of scripts and packages. How many? Okay, this is actually cool. Also, okay, we only have this in uslib two, and it's like basically YOLO whatever, right? So we don't need to tell them um, each time here. Um, Because the user doesn't care, right? It's it's basically, and I I only thought that to basically yesterday or so. I even I don't see it often. Like 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 this is cluttering the build output. Like nobody cares, right? Um, and it takes attention away from the really important things. So. Remove uclipc and new. Pending a patch message, um, and that is just adding to the overall quality. Because if you then build from Musil.ly like every other package, you get some appending Musil patches. Like 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 you. Yes, okay, the code path works. Congratulations, um, but it, it's basically pointless to tell the user each time, right? So like continue. Um, it's like continue. Yes, it gets gets old after a while, select, continue, full install, select, select. Um, all right, usually I don't, I don't see the black bar there because this terminal is black, right? Okay, it's only in full screen, full screen, uh, stone. Yes, yes, that looks like shit. That's a, okay, so because so here we anyway have okay, right? So continue, okay. Okay, this is cancel. Um, so that's what we just touched. Okay, so because probably cancel here is because it's. Should we have continued there too? Okay, continue. Yeah. Should we have at least continued there? So I continue. Hmm, it's a little bit inconsistent. Should this simply be which one was it? This one, right? I, in, was it input? Uh, yeah, it was this one. No cancel. Okay, or maybe we simply make it continue just to be con more consistent. Otherwise, it's only. Um, cancel button. 
I can see the label, yeah. Maybe we leave it as that, so that is no console, it is console. Maybe we leave it okay, cancel, cancel just, just to be more consistent. So I think we're finally done, so like continue, continue. It's, I think it's a, an improvement. How long did it probably? Yeah, of course, an hour. So quit there. And there, so that, what was it, Musil, right? So I guess that's probably mostly it, except testing this, building this a little bit. It sounds a little bit, so you're saying fresh, so probably Luke also builds from you look, uh, probably built in from a recent T2 installation, I would guess. Actually, for this, we wouldn't need to regenerate it, but uh, that's what it is. Just making sure it's, of course, super repetitive in the meantime. But hey, development is. Whatever you develop, most likely development. If you think IT is cool, IT is mostly super repetitive. Um, so yeah, email recommendation, rename this to return to main menu, not followed, but point taken. I hope that's a huge, huge improvement and certainly more balanced named labels than super over long return to main menu, which mostly it isn't. Um, Select continue, select, select. So um, we probably want to patch uh, the to do we just had there of uh, x86 64 musel, no clear source, it was five in it. To patch this default there. So select. Yeah, more patches welcome if this button still trigger you. Select continue. Okay, here is okay. Wait, this is still cancel. Oh wait, is it, uh, did, did I name this cancel or no? Did I not rebuild this? This UI input, right? Did I not okay, cancel? Ah, because I was stupid. Good that we tested this. At least no typo for runtime error. Um, okay, continue. It's like, yeah. Okay, fine. I guess it makes sense that this is. Um, so just consistently continue. So what else do we have there? Uh, French install, basic, it's a fresh install. So ISO, including, so Linux. Um, <coughs> good. Um, those five units. So here we wanted from earlier in this live stream patch this VT102. I believe it was in here, VT102. Uh, actually, that is funny. Um, VT102. Um, is that that one? Is this where it's adding check kernel console? I oh, is auto auto console. Um,
I'm a little bit surprised it runs this with dash s. We probably want to patch that too because without any argument um, what is dash is it, uh, what was dash j no clear do not clear the screen before printing um, what is dash l Local line, control not line flex, uh, whatever I guess. And dash s is, is it speed? I thought. Insert the system name. Is that seriously? Oh, this is not. Why do I not find here 8 8 bit? 8 bit clean, seriously? Eh. Why does this? I don't instantly see. Is it? It, it is, was a, a Getty, wasn't it? A Getty? Dash. I mean, obviously, it's about speed. I just thought that it's a different. Ah, maybe, maybe it is unrelated. Actually, maybe as is. Maybe this is not. Yeah, previous, previously video years ago. Command line parsing it would actually be good if you could see like. If there would be standards so that you could see if that belongs to the previous argument. Probably it's unrelated um, because I thought. Um, I hear keep baud, try to keep the existing baud rate, um, receive the break character. Um, the baud rates from the command line are used when AGT receives a break character. If another baud rate specified, then the original baud also saved at the end of. Board rate list is used to return or board rate of the unexpected breaks. Um, I never used that and what was L now? So wait, does it not without any board rate? I believe it is already um, comma separate list more board rates receives a break it advances through the list which treats it as where circular should be specific descending order so that the null character can also be used for board rate switching is optional and unnecessary logical. By default, the serial terminals is keep the current board rate, see dash dash keep and if unsuccessful, then default to 9600. Um, I think because I never used this other fancy stuff and it never was a problem. I think I don't use that here um, unless someone like yeah. that is the thing, right? People add fancy stuff and it's causing more problems than good. Because I just recently removed, like a year, just recently a year ago, removed the board rate list here. Um, because I, I find it obviously like if you have. Like you operate the bootloader, you usually see kernel command line stuff and you don't want to switch the board rate. Uh, what was dash j? I think I locked this up a second ago. No clear, not sure why. Oh, what was dash l? Local line. Auto always never is submitted since it was always local and given default. Force the line to be local line, which no need to carry detection. Okay, interesting. Mm, never used that probably either, did I? Ah no, we we have here for local line. Yeah. Mm, doesn't sound too bad. The other was dash j, right? Not Did I ever? 
what was and so what we wanted to patch because like that is what we actually wanted to patch so serial uh, This is a super modern choice, might be controversial, leave them in the comments below. Again, user recommendation um, of other professional users and I kind of sort of agree for modern use. Um, if you want something else, I guess. Mm. Default. Oh, yeah. um, also then is that even it you see in a tab of that might let's use the same here for just for external color um common there sometimes get a build error if to verbose build with no verbose build, it's fine. I never have seen that it breaks. Okay, I've seen this def TTY, but okay, that is bizarre. Yeah, patches welcome. I usually don't do verbose builds because they hide all the other precious, useful stuff. Um, uh, if you have time to do, to, I mean, I build verbose and didn't have a problem, but I've seen this def TTY recently. Like, yeah, the only constant is changing and regressions, right? You polish so much stuff and then other strange. I mean, maybe due to even a change of hours or just upstream changes. Um, so let's, for a test build, rebuild our most popular x86 default stuff here. Best with our typo. And so we have done other to do's. We have done that here. Uh, we should do that. Um, I so we have done that too, I believe. Emerge on your systems. Okay, this did not occur again. Maybe this was actually broken. It's probably if I see it again, it uh, debug it. So basically, I've kinder done that. Didn't okay. Let's let's leave it here because I changed it, but I didn't, didn't see much effect. So then let's build our most popular target and soon release it. I mean, maybe a handful of nice to have things. I hope you enjoyed this and learned something. If you agree with uh, that this is an improvement, leave in the comments below. If you have other suggestions, comment as well. Or actually, you know what? If you agree with this polished labels, give it a thumbs up. Share like, share like and subscribe. Otherwise, comment below. I hope you enjoyed this and learned something hanging about, uh, around here, co-working or whatever, together. Maybe Patreon, GitHub sponsor. Otherwise, have a good day and night, stay healthy, and I hope to see you soon for all the next fun, continued development in the microkernel to come.